Yes, hi again. Uh, this is Melek Yachian, and today we will look, talk about uh, still practical defense. It's kind of continuation of that theme. Uh, today, actually, I'm going to start a new theme, which we will call uh, uh, counterattack. Uh, basically, it's about how uh, to use a uh, most aggressive way to defense, how to use attack as defensive stuff. And uh, I will start uh, this theme by one of the most famous games which has been played uh, by this theme. It's back to 1970, uh, Time Man of Has a White versus Larson. So, in this position, uh, Larson decided not to defend d5 isolated pawn by normal way, let's say rook d8, for instance, here, or at some point maybe try to play uh, bishop e6. He decided uh, to start his counterattack. Uh, based on situation, uh, the white king still kind of stuck in the center. And besides, uh, black has two bishops, a uh, pair of the bishops, and uh, Larson believed that will give him chance to uh, create a nice uh, counterattack. So his move was amazing. He went here, g5. Well, the idea is very simple. Uh, he's trying to use geometry. So let's say if white will try to take the pawn, for instance, um, if it tries to take the pawn by bishop, then after capturing back on g5, black has d4, attacking the knight, and attacking the knight, the other knight. So both knight hangs, and black will simply uh, take a piece, gain a piece. So white cannot do that. The only move to go is a bishop g3. In fact, also very dangerous for white to play here bishop e5. Uh, but by the same reason, kind of uh, white putting the piece on the fifth rank, and after g4, uh, looks like the only option remain for white it's uh, to take on d5. And here, black has a really amazing move. It's bishop d8. I have to explain uh, why not queen d5, pretty much natural move, because knight d5 in the case of g takes f3 sounds like black is going to win a piece, but in fact after rook takes f6 it's a um, different result, because after bc knight e7 it's actually mate. So black has to play this tricky move bishop d8. And after bishop d8, white must take on a5, bishop a5, keeping the, queen, uh, the pin, and most important, still both pieces, knight f3 and bishop e5, hanging. And after this, the only move is bishop f6, gf, gf, simplification, and simply run away. We hope you enjoyed this video demo from chess.com. Subscribe today to finish this video and get unlimited access to our full video library. Your membership also includes access to Chess Mentor, the most advanced interactive training tool available anywhere. You'll also get full access to the Opening Explorer, Tactics Trainer, and much, much more. So sign up today and get serious about improving your game.